Hi guys and welcome to Time Stable Generator in Python using while loop. So let me show you guys how to put something like this together. So let's exit out. I'm going to first of all start by just declaring a variable. So declare a variable I'll call that i then let's assign a value to i and I'm going to then just say y i is less than and equals to 12 and I'm going to declare another variable I call that j and the value of j is 1 okay and I'm going to repeat exactly the same thing right here say y j is less than and equals to 12 now let's print this out let's go right underneath j here and just enter print the following well i'm going to first of all let's just say create a string there and i'm going to enter i multiply by j close that bracket up then we we'll say plus and i'm just going to then enter a tab to give each number a space and let's just enter and that will be equals space close that up and what i then need to do now is to increment j come right down here and let's just say j plus equals one and i'm going to have to repeat the same thing for i but before then we need to let's scroll down and just ask it to print and next we say i plus equals one right Okay, yeah. I think we are done, but let's save this first. Just going to save it as times table generator. There we go. Click on save. Let's go in here and just run it and see. There we go. Look at that. Okay. But one thing I want to do next is I'm going to add a title. So let's come right up here. And I'm just going to say print. First of all, I want it to go to new lines twice, and I want it to get tab. Just enter about four there. There. And now I will then enter my timetable. Let's just call that times table generator. So that's the title. Close that up. There we go. Alright, so if I run it now, this is what you guys should see. Let's run this and you see what I'm talking about. There. Okay, well, the one I showed you guys previously has was underlined. So let's get this underlined and so add a bit of room to it. So I'm going to copy all of these again. Let's paste it right underneath there. And let's say get rid of all of this and close this up. Now I'm going to say plus speech mark minus close that speech mark and let's say multiply that and get it blend. Then the value that we want in there is times table. There. And I think that is it. So I'm going to also add a line underneath here just to give it sorry to go to new new line. There we go. Okay. Very hard. We have four here, one, two, three, four, and we have another four here. Then this is the underline that will go that should go underneath. I think that is it. It's two space below. Okay, let's save and run. Here we go. Look at that, guys. That's how you generate your times table using a while loop.
Let's have a good look at the lines of codes right there. So with that, I'm going to call it the end of this tutorial. I suppose you guys enjoyed it. You all have a nice day now, and bye for now.